Chinese power, Alabama power, we are going to ban each other. Hey, hold up, homie. Pause. Deontay Wilder, is he going down the same road that he went down when he first fought Tyson Fury, well, at least in the second fight? Now, if you look at the screen, you'll see that Michael Benson tweeted the weigh-in numbers. Deontay Wilder weighed in 214. Zane Zane weighed in 282. This guy is 282 pounds. It says that Zang is 68 pounds heavier than Wilder ahead of tomorrow night. A lot of people feel like that that's going to play a factor. I think that it's going to play a factor to a certain extent. Now, Wilder can go in there and just be the Wilder that he said he's going to be, you know, the one that he was before. He can go ahead and get the guy out of there. The fact that the guy is heavier, he probably get fatigued way quicker than Wilder would. But at the same time, if he hold on and start grabbing on to Wilder, it could make Wilder fatigued as well, the same way it did with Tyson Fury. And that right there was one of Tyson Fury's strategy, is to throw his weight around. He even said that that's what he was going to do. Grab on Deontay Wilder and tire him out. Now you have to wonder, is Jay Lee Zhang going to do the same thing? Is he going to try to use his weight as a factor in this fight? We've seen Deontay Wilder get fatigued before because of something like that. But then again, we've seen him come back. We've seen him be able to recover. That's one thing about his recovery rate. He has a great recovery rate. Now in that second fight, you know, he looked very fatigued. He looked disoriented. And even before Tyson Fury hit him in his equilibrium. I know that's what people are going to say. Well, because he hit him in equilibrium. Well, I mean, he was looking like that way before that. And then come to find out because he was fatigued. And Tyson Fury weighed 272 during that fight. Now this guy right here is weighing 286. So... You have to wonder, is this going to play a big part when it comes to Wilder versus Zane? Even though this is a thing, I'm going to still have to stick with what I said. I said that I feel like Wilder will get him out of there because I feel like he's going to gas out first. And I feel like him weighing this much is going to make him gas out even quicker. I think Wilder just going to have to try to be light on his feet and make sure this guy not grabbing him all night. And I think when it comes to his fatigue, he'll be okay. I mean, both guys are pretty old, you know, they're both around their 40s. So, I mean, that also play a factor. But... Even though he weighs 68 pounds more than Wilder, I still got Wilder winning this fight by knockout.